shut down when it was on a scouting run. Which was uh, quite nice. Yeah, we will redirect him. Really. Just that he can fly quicker there. Because they tend to fly like a. in a. in a. In a such a manner that this is a direct route, it's quicker. So, let's land the run and engage it. I get loads of weapons and equipment from it. I like it. He's still weak. What the fuck? He should really have improved himself by now. Well, we can't have everything, right? And we're fighting in the forest again. Actually, this is a terror ship, right? Oh, please don't, Sectoids. Please no, Sectoids. Oh, okay. It was actually a floater crew, so... <laughs> oh! Hello there! A prisoner! A prisoner of war! Why is he still so weak? Okay, he's actually. Uh, he's at the. at the gap. Um, let's use the tank here to scout our uh, backyard. Ooh! <laughs> that was quite a good decision to do so. Sonically tap scout in the backyard. Um, he has. he's carrying a pistol. And I can't see which weapon he's wearing, so I'm trying to kill him. Yeah, I was right, he was. Uh, he was actually wearing a heavy plasma. Which is uh, one of the most deadly weapons in the game, and. Um, yeah, you don't. Oh, no, actually. Hello. Oh. Meet my rocket launcher. It's nice to have rocket launchers. They kill these creatures so quickly. That's really nice. And uh, yeah, we. I guess we can also kill him. Try it. Perfect. Let's uh, move a little bit further ahead here. Just get a few of the things though. So we cleared our landing zone so far out. And we will actually need to get the smoke grenade here. Uh, it's time again for Isal, Mr. Isal. Throw his uh, smoke grenade out there. And we need some guys protecting our sides. And of course, our uh, back. And, um, throwing costs 13 for you, so you can at least move two tiles, okay. Throw it like here. And my commander. Nah, he's a good soldier. I like it. And he's actually a colonel now. Quite nice. Smoke it up in the air. Floaters are actually easy prey. 
what I'm actually wondering is, um, we have here the backyard of UFO, um, if we will actually get uh, some earlier amount of this UFO, since we shut it down, I doubt it, but you never know, it can happen. It actually can happen, okay, so we can actually scout there. The question is, uh, who I want to use to scout. I'm pretty sure that uh, there are no enemies here in this corner. Let's uh, anyway, let's check it quickly. Oh, what are you doing? Okay, no, there is no one around here, so we try not here. Uh, move a little bit further ahead. Direction time, okay, 55, I can live with that. <coughs> Deploying in all directions. He really needs to improve his time units. Soldier on the battlefield. Oh, he's only uh, major minor league wounded. That's actually okay. Yeah, and there he is. You should increase your shooting accuracy quite a bit. Actually, uh, hey, <laughs> no, we will lose some loot here, but uh, I don't want that, so I'm actually going to kill him with the laser rifles. <laughs> Can I move forward one tile to see if there is? Um, okay, he's not seeing that. This one, okay. And the commander will actually shoot last. Let's uh, shoot, him, shoot him first. Oh really? Was it train away? Okay. Okay, so we did get the kill. Well, uh, we are going to uh, flank here. Oh really, he can't move that far. Bugger. I 
he's a well, lot of other ones here. He's only minorly wounded. He's like uh, one or two days out of the uh, out of the game, though. So that's okay. <laughs> a terror ship. That will give us loads of money. If it give us uh, enough money, we can actually start building our uh, production base. It would be nice. But I don't think so. We won't be getting that much money from it. Okay, so we have a clear view here, and we can advance with all those guys. Quite nicely. So far we've killed out uh, uh, four of their terror units and also a couple of down their troops. And actually you shouldn't be running around with the rocket launcher all the time. If you're getting caught at doing some wrecked fire, you should be having a laser pistol. If they're So we can put these uh, guns away easily, so it doesn't matter that much. Snapshots. Yeah, let's take snapshots. Okay. Can she move uh, back further? No. Our commander can actually move here. Turn for a snapshot. Yeah, no, she is missing. Trying to provoking the enemy here. Let's uh, fire a rocket. Make sure he's dead. You don't want to run in the, the, into uh, Reapers and close combat. You really don't want that to happen to you guys. They're really nasty in close combat. It's like a instant uh, kill. We have an enemy sighting here. Um, let's get out a grenade too. And um, throw this grenade over the UFO. Why? It's just, um, you just have to. Okay, you can throw it like that. Okay, never mind that. 
Uh, maybe he will come around the corner. And we'll get uh, some reaction fire in his face. It'll be quite nice. <laughs> oh no, a standard grenade killed him. Well, because it does uh, four times more damage for a four field unit. So we've gotten rid of um, one more, uh, two more terror units. So we can actually hit once here. And uh, next turn, uh, try to anti the UFO. There's no real reason uh, doing reaction to training at the moment. With this uh, kind of map, it's quite too, uh, with this kind of UFO, it's quite too risky. Because it, uh, the rebels, I'm gonna storm this UFO no matter what. I want the money it will provide me. So. And I have the man, the right mats to do it, to storm it, so I do have two rocket launcher dudes which will basically de-waste anything which uh, is inside if they enter. So I think I should be fine. That's actually a bad position to put him. Put a meat shield in front of him. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, this seems a little bit risky here. Let's actually take a look inside the UFO. Okay, um, he is a problem. Okay, we lost his body. Move out. And move away. We have a rocket launcher here. Ready to be fired uh, upon this idiot there. Let's uh, choose another angle. Let's fire this rocket. Uh, which killed and destroyed some more load. Well, we are moving it from the other side. He's moved. Um, that's actually not where I wanted you to go, but um, okay. It happens sometimes. Uh, okay, he's actually. I put him here in a bad spot. Um, let's get these guys down there. Uh, okay, you actually have a scanner. Okay, we should. Use that as an advantage. Um, maybe place him here and scan a little bit to see uh, where the enemies are actually located. Most of them will be on the second floor, which we actually we can do this quite cheaply and just shooting rockets on the floor. Oh, and they are going. 